All right, welcome to Numbers with your bro. Right, I did my halftime speech yesterday. I was going to do this video last night, but I uh, decided to hop on some lives. And... But recapping the game of Washington and Texas, uh, that was an awesome game. It should have actually just a, a blowout. Uh, but a muff punt, some turnovers. Um, and as everybody knows, I predicted the score to be 38 to 23. And yes, you can still tip me at Cash App, Money Sign, Big Perp 12, and or PayPal, GY471. Um, it's the same person. My Cash App's on my PayPal. My PayPal's on my Cash App. They're all connected. It's all connected together, bro. And this is why it's funny, bro. I'm looking. Everything about this picture cracks me up. Literally everything. Even my shirt. Check it out. My shirt cracks me up, bro. I mean, if we're looking at the numbers, right? I had what well, you dub to get 38. They had 31. They were gonna had a chance to get a touchdown to get 38. Uh, instead, turned the ball over. But this is why it's funny, bro. 30 instead my halftime speech says they're gonna play lights out and They scored nothing in the third Texas scored nothing in the third nothing And I said maybe 25 and if you look at the score halftime score 21 to 21 is physically possible to get 25 points unless there was two safeties So you ask what well, what do you mean 25? But how do you get 25? And I said, well, look, the last play of the game. And of course, 38, which what I had minus the one point right there, 27. But if you want to look at it from another perspective, let's look at this. 25 plus 5 plus 1. 31. Right, we'll go over here too and I... Oh! Hold on. I gotta get... Man, this thing just keeps... Just follows me, bro. If you look over here, look at that. 23. <laughs> 23. And that's what I had for the Texas scores. 23. Right? But if you add these up, 27. And who knows what this guy is. This guy could be like 65, 85, 95... So either way, bro, the numbers added up, and this shirt just cracks me up. I knew they were going to win. I was hoping by a bigger margin, but I guess, see? Well, look at that. Huh. Anyways, that's what you, bro, the numbers, the signs. And Michael Pettix Jr. has yet to say he's played his best game. That was a good game, 450 yards, but... What if he actually plays a perfect game against the Michigan Wolverines? And what's funny is I grew up in uh, Friday Harbor, Washington. My high school mascot was a Wolverine. Live in New York now, but grew up in Washington. Ain't that a trip, bro? Numbers with your bro. I mean, that, that, it just doesn't get no better than that. It just tickles my pickle all day. That's what you broke. The numbers. The signs. <laughs>